Good morning there. This is Pastor Jeff. This is our daily lectionary readings for Saturday, January 21st, 2023. We have our three readings today. Psalm 27, 1 through 6 is our psalm reading. 1 Samuel chapter 15, starting in verse 34, carrying on into chapter 16, verse 13 is our Old Testament reading. And then our New Testament reading comes from the Gospel of Luke chapter 5, verses 27 through 32. Today we will be reading out of the New Revised Standard Version, the updated edition. Psalm 27, 1 through 6. The Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? The Lord is the stronghold of my life. Of whom shall I be afraid? When evildoers assail me to devour my flesh, my adversaries and foes, they shall stumble and fall. Though an army encamp against me, my heart shall not fear. Though war rise up against me, yet I will be confident. One thing I ask of the Lord, this I seek. To live in the house of the Lord all the days of my life. To behold the beauty of the Lord and to inquire in his temple. For he will hide me in his shelter in the day of trouble. He will conceal me under the cover of his tent. He will set me high on a rock. Now my head is lifted up above my enemies all around me. And I will offer in his tent sacrifices with shouts of joy. I will sing and make melody to the Lord. Our Old Testament reading comes from the book of 1 Samuel, chapter 15, 34. Carrying on through chapter 16, verse 13. Then Samuel went to Ramah, and Saul went up to his house in Gibah of Saul. Samuel did not see Saul again until the day of his death, but Samuel grieved over Saul. And the Lord was sorry that he had made Saul king over Israel. The Lord said to Samuel, How long will you grieve over Saul? I have rejected him from being king over Israel. Fill your horn with oil and set out. I will send you to Jesse the Bethlehemite, for I have provided for myself a king among his sons. Samuel said, How can I go? If Saul hears of it, he will kill me. And the Lord said, Take a heifer with you and say, I have come to sacrifice to the Lord. Invite Jesse to the sacrifice, and I will show you what you shall do. And you shall anoint for me the one whom I name to you. Samuel did what the Lord commanded and came to Bethlehem. The elders of the city came to meet him, trembling, and said, Do you come peacefully? He said, Peacefully. I have come to sacrifice to the Lord. Sanctify yourself and come with me to the sacrifice. And he sanctified Jesse and his sons and invited them to the sacrifice. When they came, he looked on Eliab and thought, Surely this is the anointed is now before the Lord. But the Lord said to Samuel, Do not look on his appearance or on the height of his statue, because I have rejected him. For the Lord does not see as mortals see. They look on the outward appearance, but the Lord looks upon the heart. Then Jesse called Abinah and made him pass before Samuel. And he said, Neither has the Lord chosen this one. Then Jesse made Shema pass by, and he said, Neither has the Lord chosen this one. Jesse made seven of his sons pass before Samuel. And Samuel said to Jesse, The Lord has not chosen any of these. Samuel said to Jesse, Are all your sons here? And he said, There remains yet the youngest, but he is keeping the sheep. And Samuel said to Jesse, Send and bring him, for we will not sit down until he comes here. He sent and brought him in. Now he was ruddy and had beautiful eyes and was handsome. 
The Lord said, Rise and anoint him, for this is the one. Then Samuel took the horn of oil, anointed him in the presence of his brothers, and the Spirit of the Lord came mightily upon David. From that day forward, Samuel then sent out and went to Ramah. Our New Testament reading today comes from the Gospel of Luke, chapter 5, verses 27 through 32. After this, he went out and saw a tax collector named Levi sitting at the tax collector's station. And he said to him, follow me. And he got up and he left everything and followed him. Then Levi gave a great banquet for him in the house. And there was a large crowd of tax collectors and others reclining at the table with them. The Pharisees and their scribes were complaining to the disciples saying, why do you eat and drink with tax collectors and sinners? And Jesus answered them, Those who are well have no need of a physician, but those who are sick I have not come to call the righteous, but sinners to repentance. And here ends our readings for the day. Hope that you have a beautiful day, and I hope to see you in church tomorrow.